Hello guys. Um, I'm about to do a pyramid mode. And I'm gonna do it from plexiglass. In order to do that, I'm gonna need a 3D model. I'm gonna need a 3D model of the Great Pyramid of Giza. I'm gonna do the mode from 10mm plexiglass and then cut it on my CNC router. The mode, I mean the mode will contain four sides and the hollow button where I'm gonna pull the resin in. So basically I need the uh, the golden ratio of the pyramid of Giza is very simple you know I've been trying lots of calculators I mean golden ratio or Fibonacci calculators on been searching on Google but uh, what is that? I don't need that anyway, Windows asking me silly questions and yeah I'm gonna draw this uh, circles, um, blue circle representing the earth and the white circle representing the moon when you connect the two sides of the blue circle and the, and the middle of the white circle then you're getting the precise proportions of the, of the pyramid the great pyramid so let's do it I'm taking it to Orion series uh, my favorite program. I'm gonna do it here. So let's draw the circles. I'm gonna open this one in new tab. Right, we've got big circle diameter 11, small circle diameter 3, one top of each other. I'm gonna draw it now. Right, 11. And on top of it, go free. Now, I'm gonna get dimension points here. Diameter dimension of the middle one. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna connect the lines. As I just did. So that's the triangle. Triangle I'm, I'm after. It's all done as far as making the triangle. Here we go. Right, so since you got the right proportions now, I'm just gonna make it slightly bigger so it's easier to work. be good for now. Control C, Control V, and now I'm gonna rotate this one. So now I'm gonna need this measurements 195 night. Uh, let's let's make it 200. That's better. Easy to work. Now what we got? Yeah. I'm gonna draw the rectangular now. I mean a square. Yeah. I'm gonna draw the square now. Just like that. Next. I'm going to do this. Um, I'm going to I'm going to get one side of the pyramid. 
Answer. Ah, but so basically, I don't need this lens anymore. That's the only thing I need. I'm gonna make it uh, planet curve. Yeah, now it's solid. After that, I'm just gonna mirror it. Okay, there you have it. Great pyramid of Giza with the precise proportions. Now, join them all together, cup it. Oops. Now I'm going to cup. Alright, so now let's cup it. I'm going to offset this surface. I'm going to set it outwards because now I've got 200 and I want to go out of that 200 I mean my plexiglass is gonna gonna go outwards so I'm gonna set it outwards all right I'm gonna select the, the solids and then I'm gonna just surface offset surface outwards 10 mil enter done there we go now we go one little pyramid inside a small pyramid I mean big pyramid and we go 10 mil distance between this side and this side and that represents my plexiglass that I'm gonna use now I'm gonna explode this pyramid and just get rid of all this stuff here. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna trim this bottom part here. In order to do that, I'm gonna need a and just draw a solid and something like that. I'm gonna throw the solid and next thing I'm gonna trim it. Just use a trim tool. No, no, I'm just gonna use a bowling split. I use this one and then this one, just split it. There we go. Oops. Uh, it didn't work. What's the problem? Alright. I'm gonna use a different way. How about... Trimming the bottom. There is always more than one way to do the job. Now I'm gonna just uh, draw sides of this pyramid and then close it. There we go. Alright, so surface planar curve. Oops, you know, whoa, come on, surface. Planet curve, oh, it did now. That's it, we got this one here. I'm gonna mirror it this one. Mirror. And there we have it. I'm just gonna join these surfaces and uh, cut the bottom. And now we have. one out of the four sides of the pyramid. I'm just gonna mirror it again. Uh, transfer mirror. Now one. 
There we have it. Now we've got a hollow mold for casting pyramids. I'm gonna cast a uh, organite here. Yeah, yeah it would be nice. Nice mold. Alright. Now all I gotta do in order to get this stuff cut on my sins every taste. Lay it flat down and just export it. Oh, I will export it as um, STL. Uh, export selected uh, STL. Uh, I'm just gonna say on the just for the say pyramids. And we're done. Simple as that. Pyramid site. We have a great pyramid of Giza ready to be cut on my face every time. Yeah. Thanks for joining me, guys. And um, I hope this tutorial will help you create a. Uh, nice modes nice pyramid modes and yeah next thing i'm gonna do is uh, i'm gonna prepare this uh, 3d module for cutting so i'm gonna use another software to set the tools and the tool paths and all that and uh, yeah join me in my next video and uh, i'll be showing you how to do that thank you